We thank you and welcome back here to the studios of TV10 in Mobile. And thank you for being with us on this Labor Day to be an important part, to be a miracle maker right here on the MDA Telethon, the 25th anniversary of the Telethon. Jerry Lewis Telethon, as a matter of fact. The number is to call 432-9020 in Pensacola. Thank you. Let's ring those phones. 456-1300. The other numbers in Monroe County and Monroeville, 743-2342. Up in Bruton, 867-4832. Crestview, 682-4822. Gulf Shores, 948-6836. Fort Walton, 862-4147. Evergreen, 578-2150. As you just saw just a couple of seconds ago, there is some headway being made in so many areas of the neuromuscular diseases that fall under the umbrella of Muscular Dystrophy Association. We can do it. We can make some strides. We can make some progress, but we need your help. Please call. I know a lot of you folks are just waking up now, enjoying your holiday, getting your holiday off to a good start. Take a moment before you take your family out to the beach, to the picnic, to barbecue, whatever. Give thanks for their help by being a part and helping to take care of some other people. Give us a call. We need to make the phone. Rub the phones. Rub the phones. Have to rub the phones so they can work. As we said, we welcome you back to the Gulf Coast segment of Jerry Lewis Labor Day Telethon. This is a vitally important part of the show. It gives all of us at Channel 10 a chance to let you know just how firm we are in our support of MDA's fight against muscular diseases. It gives us also a chance to ask you to help MDA to win this all-important battle. Now, you've heard Jerry Lewis. You know that we can do it. And we've got to have your support, your pledge to make it all happen. So let's hear from you right now. I hear those phones ringing right now. Please call us with your pledge as we continue on. And by the way, in case you're wondering just what is muscular dystrophy, here's Bob Griff to give us some facts. Bob? More than one million Americans have muscular dystrophy. It can strike anyone at any age. Muscular dystrophy is marked by progressive weakness of the skeletal muscles. There is no cure and no way to arrest the disease process. A motorized wheelchair costs between $7,000 to $9,000, the price of a car. MDA programs are funded almost entirely by individual private contributions. But with the continued help of concerned individuals who contribute their time and energy to the fight against neuromuscular disease, it will be possible for MDA to continue its worldwide research effort to aid patients and their families. There's still much more to be achieved. Pick up the phone and pledge your support. Thank you, Bob. That's just some of the facts about MDA here in the Mobile, Pensacola area. The phone number now in Mobile is 432-9020, and the phones have begun to ring this morning. Finally, 432-9020. I understand that the cable system in Pensacola was out for a while, but it's back in operation, so if you were getting us off of the rabbit ears, you can switch back to cable right now. The Pensacola number is 456-1300, 456-1300, that is the Pensacola number, and you can charge it to MasterCard or Visa by any of the numbers you see on the screen. So call the number, give us your Visa number, and we'll be glad to write it up for you. Here are some of the pledges we've received in the past hour or so. David Connolly, $5, Susanna Knapp, $7, $20 to Calvin Murph, uh, Angel Bryant, $2, $10 to Brenda Gibson of Silas, Alabama. From Monroeville, Rebecca Benton, $10, $26. From Clarence Wentworth and Kathy Sharp, $1. We thank you all for those pledges. Now, don't forget now, if you do pledge $100 or $200, we're putting stars on the board. 
$100 gives you a silver star, and a gold star comes up with uh, $200. Some of the people I didn't read last time are way off on the right side, uh, left side there. The Olive Garden, $100. Fleet Transport Company, $100. We thank you for that. Please make the phones ring, and you'll be helping to fight muscular dystrophy. 432-9020, 432-9020. You know these children need the appliances we've talked about, the, the wheelchairs, the special braces. They also need therapy, which is done, of course, here in the local hospitals. So call and pledge your support, $5, $2, $10, whatever. Some of the people working the phones today are from uh, across the bay at Westminster Village. We have some people from Alabama Power Company, and all these guys with these light blue shirts on there with the Coast Guard here in the Mobile area. Area. They've been pledging their time and they're answering the phones. We ask you to call and make these guys work, okay? 432-9020. Byron, I think you have a special guest now. Yeah, we do, John Ed. And before we forget about the Coast Guard celebrating their 200th anniversary this year, so some congratulations to all of our Coast Guard personnel. With me right now is Mr. Howard Mosley. Saw Howard just a few minutes ago on a public service announcement talking about the importance of MDA to all of us here in Mobile. Howard is with the National Association of Letter Carriers, a local chapter in Mobile. And Howard, I believe you got a little, little check for us, huh? Yeah, I got a check for $6,600. $6,600, Howard. Listen, you guys, thanks very much. We appreciate that. How did you raise this money? Uh, we had a bullathon, a golf tournament, and roadblock. And what, who were some of your sponsors, by the way? Uh, some of the sponsors were Florida Bowl and the Bullathon, Isaiah City Golf Club, uh, Grady Azuzu, Allied Alarms, and uh, American Postal Workers Union, and, yeah. uh, and the Post Office. Yeah. You can't leave them out. A lot of good folks getting behind you guys. We appreciate that. $6,600. And How did Dave Straker play in the golf tournament, by the way? How did he do? Uh, I don't. I don't remember. I had a hard enough time keeping up with my own score. <laughs> Howard, listen. Thank you very much. We appreciate this so very much. Best of luck to you guys. Thanks again. We'll see you next year. Okay. That was Howard Mosley uh, with the National Association of Letter Carriers with this fine check for six thousand six hundred six dollars. Listen, you don't have to give six thousand dollars. All you need to give is a dollar, five dollars, ten dollars, whatever you can spare. We need it. We need it. Call the numbers on the screen. Give us a call. Get in touch with us so you can help others. Right now, we're going to go to jail with John Ed Thompson. Jet? Okay. Do not pass go. Do not collect $200. Go directly to jail. We've got some people in the jailhouse here at Channel 10, and uh, we're going to see what it takes to get them out. I'm going to put the mic down and see what we can do by talking on the phone into the people in the jail cell. Okay, checking. Is anybody in there? Who am I speaking to? This is Melanie Lucas. Hello, Melanie. Uh, tell me what's going on in there. Well, everybody's making several calls. We're trying to make some money so we can get out of jail. Okay, have you set a goal for yourself? Uh, basically, our goal is about $250, so oh. we're going to try to meet that, everybody. If we make more, that's fine. Okay, so in other words, we got four people sitting here and an extra guy down there. You didn't give him a prison outfit. I don't know. I guess he's going to, is he going to get $250, too? Yes, sir. Uh -huh. okay. We don't let the costumes be restrictive. <laughs> okay, so you're calling your friends. If they get a call from you, they're going to donate some money, right? Right. And then we're going to let you out of jail, maybe. Well, we hope so. <laughs> okay. Of course, we'll stay if we can help some more. Okay, great. Pass, pass the phone over to this guy right here. Okay, be glad to. I believe that looks like Willie the Actor Sutton, a famous bank robber. Uh, are you from Kansas, by the way? <laughs> no, not quite. What's your name? Richard Waters. Richard, uh, how, how much money you gotten so far? Oh, uh, not that much. I'm still trying. <laughs> so you got to get 250 before let, we let you out, right? Absolutely. Are the hamburgers already thawed? The hamburgers already thawed. <laughs> <laughs> In other words, if, if you don't hurry up and get out, those hamburgers will get too warm. You're not going to be able to cook them this afternoon. Well, I believe that's correct. <laughs> okay. You, uh, if somebody ca wants to call in and donate money in your name, I guess they could do that too, right? right couldn't they? Right. The number's 432-9020. Okay, all right, that's the mobile number now. Got a couple of people in jail here, and uh, it looks like they're busy working up some money. So how about you calling your pledge in? If you want to say, I want to donate a couple of dollars to the guys in jail, you can do that as well. Now, the mobile number is 432-9020, and here's a guy that's not in jail but should be Byron Dunn. <laughs> I was going to say the same thing about you, my man. Uh, I tell you what, it really puts you on the spot to find out if you got $250 worth of friends out there. <laughs> We do have some pledges that we want to read off right now. Apex Motors just called in with a pledge, $250 from Apex Motors. We appreciate that, guys, very much. B.N. Barclay of Mobile, $25. Stephanie Walker, Mobile, $10. Uh, Jack and Lucy Pratt of Mobile, $25. Penny Anthony, Mobile, also pledged. Martha Smith of Sarah Land, she pledged $10. Emily Anthony, Mobile, pledged $5. Uh, Daphne High School, we've gotten their pledge already. Bobby Heiner, $20. Bay Manette, uh, someone from Bay Manette called with a $5 pledge. A grandmother 
from Bila Battery called in to give us a pledge. See, that's all it takes. Your neighbors, your relatives, your grandmother, your aunt, your uncle, picking up the phone, giving a call. Hey, you know what? When you call, after you make the call, why don't you call a couple of other people and say, you know what? I just made a pledge in your name. Why don't you make a pledge in someone else's name? That way you get the entire community involved. All you got to do is pick up the phone, 432-9020. In Pensacola, 456-1300. You see the other numbers on the screen if you're in the Channel 10 viewing area. Just pick up the phone. Give us a call. Don't forget, you can use your MasterCard, your Visa, your American Express. Hey, too many times we use those cards for a lot of things that make us happy. Now let's try and make some other people happy by using our credit cards. Right now, let's listen to a very special message from a very special lady, Dr. Yvonne Kennedy with Bishop State Community College. Hello, I'm Yvonne Kennedy, president of Bishop State Community College. A neuromuscular disease may be able to stop a child from walking or running but it can't stop his or her mind from growing, and it can't lessen his or her need for a good education. The people at MDA know that. They're helping kids with neuromuscular diseases to learn by providing special equipment like powered wheelchairs to help Jerry's kids get from class to class and often from home to school too. For many of these kids, this can mean the difference between getting nowhere and getting the education they need. In this way, MDA is helping to make it possible for many young people to attend high school and college to lead fuller, richer lives. Please help MDA to keep doing this. Make your pledge now for as much as you can. Thank you. Hey, how about that? Now, that is the president of uh, Bishop State Community College here in town and uh, a great woman and a great school, too. We've got a couple of great women here, too. We've got Ardelia Travis, and right beside me, we've got Renee Thompson. Renee and I were checking our genealogy, and we've traced it all the way back to Laurel, Mississippi, but we haven't gotten it any further than that. Uh, you're with the Kindercare people, and I understand you've gotten some money, right? Yes, we do, John Ed. Each year, Kindercare makes a commitment to MDA. And throughout the year, the children and the parents at Kinder Care participate in events such as sleepovers, hopathons, or dinosaur stomps this year, right? We were on TV for that. Uh, spaghetti suppers, anything that we could do to raise money for muscular dystrophy. Our staff people cheerfully donate their time during these events so that Kinder Care can follow through with its commitment to MDA because teach, we teach the young people about what this is all about right exactly it's a very good community involvement project for the children because they're learning to help others and we are really proud of our involvement our kids think it's wonderful um, because they can see this as a result and they know that these are their dollars that they raised um, and how much money did we get hmm this year, the Kinder Care Learning Centers in Mobile and Baldwin Counties have $6,428. Over $6,000. As a matter of fact, $6,428. R.D., I know you didn't get to talk much, but we enjoyed having you here. Thank you very much. We enjoyed it. Working for MDA. How about that? From Kinder Care, and we thank you very much, and maybe we'll have you back next year, maybe getting $6,500, okay? Okay, then. here's Byron. All right, John Ed, we have the veritable plethora of special guests down here at this end of the studio, as a matter of fact. I want to introduce a couple of special people right away. Our poster kids from Mobile, of course, first of all, is Patrick Morris. You might have seen Patrick with that rap song that he had out. I think it's number 20 on the charts with a bullet right now. Is that right? I don't know. And Nicole Morris, uh, 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 I'm sorry, Nicole Wilson, our, our poster child from Pensacola. Let's have a big hand for these two, uh, these two folks who have joined us here in the studio this morning. Thank you. Thanks, kids. It's good to see you from last year. Of course, mom and dad are along with them. But we have a special presentation. I mentioned the Coast Guard celebrating their 200th anniversary this year of service to the United States. And behind me, of course, is Captain Francis Owen, captain of the port here in Mobile. Captain uh, Dick uh, uh, Cash Dollar also with us. And uh, over here on my left, Captain Bob Busick. And Captain Busick has a special presentation to make to our, our children. Captain Busick. You know, there are over a thousand Coast Guard people here in Mobile, and we, uh, we kind of consider ourselves a family. We provide search and rescue services, law enforcement services, and maritime safety services all to uh, the people here in Mobile. In addition to that, we train Coast Guard aviators from all over the United States. 
to kind of make uh, Nicole and Patrick members of our Coast Guard family, we thought we'd make them honorary air crewmen. So mm. I have these two, uh, two plaques to, uh, to give to them to make them honorary air crewmen. Patrick. Isn't that great? Patrick and Nicole. And I also have these, I also have these uh, air crew wings for you to wear to remember us, okay? How about that? And we'd like it very much if you'd come on out and see us sometime, and we'll show you the real airplane. Let me tell you something, guys. I've been on the Falcon. It's a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun. What do you think? What do you think about that, Patrick? Fun. <laughs> I think he's trying to decide if he really wants to go up or not. Nicole, would you like to try that? Like to go out and visit the guys out there? Sure. Yeah, why not? Why not? I know, you know. That social calendar is very busy. But listen, thank you. Thank you very much, and we appreciate it, as always. Everyone's support. The Coast Guard has been such a major part of this community, and we appreciate your support each and every day. Believe me. Gentlemen, thank you very much, and we appreciate our children, too, very much as well. Okay, let's go back to John Edge. Jet. Thank you, Byron. Uh, we've got these people working, as we talked about, you know, donating their time and their energy. And uh, we talked to Mrs. Andre earlier, Lily An Andre, from up around uh, Mount Vernon and uh, up around Chestang. Well, she's got a lot of grandchildren, and so she has donated $50 uh, because she's got a lot of healthy grandchildren. So thank you very much, Ms. Andre. And we're going to put that right here. We're going to collect that money later on. Some of the other people who've called in, now the phone numbers are on your screen, so if you're in one of those cities, use that number. If you're in Mobile, our number is 432. 9020-432-9020. Karen Watson of Mobile, a $20 pledge. David uh, Pettibar, or, or Pettibone, I believe, believe it is, of Foley, Alabama. I'm sorry about that last name, uh, uh, David. $10 pledge. Thank you very much. $10 also from uh, Betty Rose of Mobile, from Silas, Brenda Gibson, a $10 pledge. We've got a $100 pledge here from Shannon Monroe. Shannon will get one of those uh, silver stars on the board, and you too can become a star. Matter of fact, if you want to get, say, 10 people together and give $10 a piece, we'll put it on the group from Glenwood Street or whatever, okay? Here's one of the reasons you should donate money each year. The people around the area go to a summer camp. This is what it looked like this year out at the USA Brooklyn Complex at summer camp. I mean, sing, like, Michael sing like that? Yeah, I know you could, but uh, oh, I'll no. do the doo in the background. And <laughs> you went to the camp this past summer, I right? certainly did, and it's, it's a great experience. They have one every year. I've been probably for the last six or eight years, and it's a fantastic deal, and they, the, the, they treat the kids yeah. great. The kids have fun. It's, well, as it's, you pointed out, there's a counselor for each child, and it's right. completely paid for. Yeah by your donations, and we need you to call 432-9020 uh, in Pensacola, 
1300. We, we have got those phones ringing. Yeah. We've gotten some of the pledges, and uh, we're trying to get Richard Walters and Melanie Lucas out. We've had a few phone calls uh, with. More right. money. They need. They, they, they need more money. That's what. They, that's <laughs> what they're saying. The folks in jail. We have. Let's go to the tow. We'll show you what you've done so far. Thank you, Mobile, Pensacola, Brood, and Crestview. Forty-two thousand twenty-nine dollars. Let's go back to Los Angeles. We'll see you in thirty minutes. Hi, I'm Norm Crosby, and I'm here to remind you that we all of us have hopes and desires for the future. But many things that we take for granted, little things, little everyday things, things that we do without thinking, are little more than distant dreams for people with devastating neuromuscular diseases. Make a pledge. You can make their dreams come true. You can even use your MasterCard, Visa, or American Express. If you use your MasterCard, MasterCard International will donate an additional dollar to Jerry's kids. Call toll-free. The number is 1-800-FIGHT-MD. Have your MasterCard, Visa, or American Express card handy when you call. That's 1-800-FIGHT-MD. Thank you, Norman. Stay with us for the next seven hours for more of the NBA Super Anniversary Telethon featuring... Cirque du Soleil, The Young Rider, and Michael W. Smith. Get involved, won't you? I'm Tom Gray, General Manager of KOMU TV in Columbia, Missouri. We broadcast the telethon for over 20 years and helped fund MBA's research programs, not only here at the University of Missouri, but around the world. Join the effort and phone in your place now. Thanks. Hello, this is Ron Samuels. And I'm Heather Samuels. And this is our son, Ronnie. Thank God our son was born normal, with no medical problems or defects of any kind. This weekend, we'd like you to help us help Jerry's kids. Help us beat last year's goal, where we raised $12,000. Every car we sell this weekend Saturday, Sunday, and Monday, we'll donate $100 to Jerry's Kids. And we are back here at the studios of TV10 on Government Street Mobile. Thank you so much for spending part of your Labor Day with us. A very, very important Labor Day. And first of all, we would like to thank Mr. and Ms. Ron Samuels for their generous offer again this year, last year. Ron Samuels donated a ton of money from people who were buying cars last year. Matter of fact, that ton was twelve thousand dollars. Well, that that's that's Great. a pretty good <laughs> bit. That's that's a big ton, a long we, ton. John Thompson here, and also a, a new person is joining us. Dave Straker, one of the mechanics from Ron Samuels <laughs> over at Pensacola. Right. That's right. I just you know changed out of my grease monkey suit, and uh, <laughs> and here I am, by God. Well, it's good to have you here. We've been having a great morning so far, and the phones are beginning to ring one more hey. time, and you're here to help us pump them up a little bit more, huh? Seventh year, Mr. Dave is here trying to raise money for muscular dystrophy, you the can fight do it, against pal. muscular dystrophy, you can do it. and I'm glad to be here. Ring. I wouldn't remember a uh, Labor Day at the beach, by God. Let's, not, <laughs> let's okay. go over here, John. I tell you, we've really got to make the phones ring. Some of those who have gotten involved today to make the phones ring here. Uh, Janelle Reddit of Bruton, a $45 pledge. Thank you. Joe Johnson of Century, Florida, a $20 pledge. Uh, B.J. Reed and Emily Reed. From the Reed family we heard from today, B.J., a dollar pledge, and Emily, $5. Thank you both. Pauline McCann of Flomaton, a $5 pledge. Alan Phillips of Destin, Florida, $100. And Moose Lodge, we heard from Moose Lodge, $21.93 in Fort Walton Beach. Thank you very much for that $50 pledge. We'd really like to hear from you today. This is your chance to be a star. It is Jerry Lewis's 25th telethon, but this could be the first telethon that you actually decided to, okay, I've watched it enough, I am going to pledge and get involved. It is your chance to get involved and make a difference in the fight against the 40 diseases that are called muscular dystrophy. Really, we would like to hear from you today. It's very simple, just pick up the phone, the telephone numbers are on your screen. If you have never called before, please make the difference today and give us a buzz. If you've called before and pledged, you can do it again this year. 
Larry and Vicki Wilkinson of Daphne, a $200 pledge. Thank you very much. Charles Idle of Saraland, we heard from Charles with a $20 pledge. Hayes Chemical Company of Mobile made a $50 pledge. Tabitha Wright of Mobile gave us $10 in the fight against muscular dystrophy. Thank you, Tabitha. Rusty and Jenny Hunt of Mobile called us up and made a $20 pledge. We also heard from Brenda Brooks today of Mobile with a $7 pledge. And I believe it's Tammy Bailey of Sarah Land, a $20 pledge. Also, James Angelico of Mobile, $25. Really, the decision is up to you whether you're going to sit back and watch the telethon and all the entertainment and not give of yourself or whether you're finally going to make the call. Please give us a call. We're, we've got phone operators on duty. We've got people out in the hallway stuffing envelopes, but all of their efforts to be here today are for naught if you really don't finally reach over to the telephone and make the call that you've been putting off for so long. It really is that easy. The operators are trained to be able to take Visa, American Express, or MasterCard pledges also, or you can donate cash. What you will receive in the mail is a little pledge form in a couple of days that will verify how much you have pledged and ask you to put it in the envelope and send it to us. It's really very simple. There won't be uh, a whole bunch of, uh, you know, 5,000 mailings during the year or anything like that. The important thing is that you finally get over to the telephone and pick it up and call and join the fight against muscular dystrophy. Also, those who have called today, Sheila Bird of Mount Vernon made a $10 pledge. Melissa Johnson of McIntosh, a $10 pledge. J.C. Jackson of Grand Bay, a $5 pledge. And Kim Cockrell of Sims, a $5 pledge. Doing what they can, Lily Ingram of Pritchard, pledge $10. Thank you, Lily. Carlton Payton of Theodore, a $50 pledge. I don't seem to be seeing many from the south part of the county. Pam Bolton of Fairhope, $20 pledge. Wayne Davis of Mobile, a $20 pledge. And James Brown of Eight Mile, a $25 pledge. Please look at the number at the bottom of your screen and give us a call right now. We can use your help. Gentlemen, what have you got on the other side of the studio for me? First of all, it's good to have you here to give us a little pump up right about mid-morning, get these phones ringing again. We have Ms. Dana Rowell with us uh, from uh, Teledyne Continental Management Association. Dana, you've got a little something for us, right? Yes, I have a donation for $500 that I'd like to present to the MDA. Ooh, well, thank you very much. We appreciate that. $500, ladies and gentlemen, from Teledyne Continental Management Association. We appreciate you folks so very much out there. Why did you choose MDA? Um, we tend to give donations to many different charitable contributions, and MDA was just one that we chose to help out this year. And there wasn't any special fundraiser. It was just, let's reach in, let's give these folks something, huh? That's right. All right. Dana, listen, thank you so much, and we appreciate you folks so very much, okay? Well, thank you. Thank you very much. Now let's go back to Dave with a couple of Pulitzer Prize-winning guys over there. Right, Dave? That is indeed Pulitzer. I like that. What a play on words. And we have some uh, gentlemen who are familiar with Pulitzer. Gentlemen from Chick-fil-A, we have Rodney Jackson, who is with the Bel Air Chick-fil-A, and Glenn Rawson, who is with the Springdale Chick-fil-A. Is that right? Did I get that right, guys? That's right. And uh, he's doing pullet jokes over there, I tell you. Uh, this, this, is, this is the day for bad jokes. Gentlemen, you've got uh, some efforts that have been going on over at the Chick-fil-A's. Why don't you tell me what's, what's been happening? Well, we are fixing to uh, start selling some coupon books that all the proceeds from the coupon go books go to m muscular dystrophy and what their coupon books are all about is their discounts uh, for product at Chick-fil-A. And, and these are not just any products, these are great tasting products too. That, that's right. Absolutely. <laughs> that's right. So uh, what we want... Nothing but great tasting products. What we want everybody to do is come down and you can come either to the Bel Air Chick-fil-A or the, the Springdale uh, location and come in and pick up a coupon book Proceeds go to a good cause. Okay, the coupon books cost one dollar, and they've got coupons worth about fifteen or sixteen dollars worth of value in them. So what a deal! Value. And the and the buck goes to fight muscular dystrophy. That's exactly. right. What a deal! And we also have a one thousand dollar pledge. I understand. Pledge. Whoa! You Thank you, gentlemen at Chick Fil A. And now back to John Ed Thompson. John Ed. Thank you, Dave. You said you want some phone calls from the south part of the county. Well, here's a phone call from Dolphin Island, $25 to one of my neighbors down there, W.K. Dunham. Mr. Dunham, we thank you very much. $25 from Dolphin Island. From over in Mississippi, from Biloxi, uh, Mr. O'Hara, $25. Thank you very much. And we understand that even though the cable system was out in Pensacola, that the phones did ring 
uh, sporadically, but they're ringing well now in Pensacola, and the phone bank in Pensacola is manned by the uh, photo school from the NAS station, okay, Naval Air Station, Pensacola, the photo school over there. They're manning the phones, and we have some of the pledges from Pensacola right now. Uh, Michael Gibbs, $26. Tim Patterson, $5. Tom Little, $300. A.W. Jones, and all of those people are from Pensacola. We thank you very much for calling in. From Mobile, Joyce Nelson, $25. The phone number in Pensacola is 456-1300. That's 456-1300, the Pensacola number. In Gulf Shores, it's not a long-distance call. Call 948-6836. And the number here in the studio is 432-9020. That's 432-9020. The phones are beginning to ring for a couple of hours this morning. It was almost like silence in here, but it's no longer that way. We like it noisy in here because it means money's coming in for the MDA. Please call right now. You too can help. $1, $2, $5, no matter what, you will be helping to fight the neuromuscular diseases all under the umbrella of muscular dystrophy. 432-9020, that is the number. 432-9020. Call right now. We're going to be here all day long, but why don't you call right now? Dave, what's going on? Oh, John Ed, we're hearing from all over. Here's a pledge from Baldwin County from Lillian, Alabama. Ron Krentz of Lillian, Alabama with a $10 pledge. Thank you, Ron. And uh, let's see, a $10 pledge from B.J. Eskreg, uh, I believe. Uh, pardon me if I mispronounced your name, of Mobile, a $10 pledge. Thank you, B.J. Uh, let's see, I believe it's a C.L. Collins of Swansea and uh, Mobile, a $50 pledge. Thank you very much. And here's a challenge to, uh, let's see, employees of uh, Mobile Infirmary. Timothy Allen of Chickasaw makes a $100 pledge. Thank you, Timothy. And let's go. Let's hear from some of the, uh, some of the hospitals out there and also you folks out at Mobile Infirmary. It's very easy. All you do is have to pick up the phone and give us a call at 432-9020. It sounds like the operators, some of them are taking pledges and some of them are kind of resting easy right now. We've got these people in here who really need to work. They came in here to answer phones and to talk to people and to take their pledges. But if they're just sitting here not taking pledges it's not really what we had in mind so please give us a call here at 432-9020 and do your part to fight muscular dystrophy there are 40 diseases that strike young people to old people that are coming under the umbrella of muscular dystrophy these are separate diseases that are very bad that really attack well any disease is very bad Dave but uh, the the important point is that dystrophy means that the muscle control, your control of your muscles gets less and less. Dystrophy meaning it gets worse and worse. They are progressive diseases. They strike the muscles, and before long, you can't use the muscles. We really need your call to help fight these diseases. 432-9020 in Mobile. In Pensacola, 456-1300. In Monroeville, 743-2342. Please, if you've never called before during a Jerry Lewis telethon, make this the day that you got involved and made your pledge to fight muscular dystrophy. We have some special guests at the other side of the studio, and let's hear from them now. Gentlemen. Thank you very much. You've heard of Wilson Phillips, a new group. We've got the Wilson boys right down here. This You may have seen Ricky and yeah. Tony earlier, John, Ed, yeah, doing the rap, the MDA right. rap. Right. And we're going to let them do it right now, as a matter okay. of fact. Are you ready? Can you guys do it? Ready to go? All right, okay. Ricky, you a one, a two. Yeah, my name is Ricky, and I'm his brother telling a story to tell about MDA. It's 25 years old, so I'll tell As you see, we got some wheels. That's what they provide. Thanks to 10 10. You can see us ride. Yeah. Right. How about yeah, it? Yeah, man. All right. <laughs> we didn't and get a chance to do the. Yeah. <laughs> like that. Yeah. Yeah. That, how did you guys come up with that? We all got together and. Well, we did in almost two hours. Mama helped us. Oh, she did? Yeah. Oh, yeah. But just a little bit, right? Yeah. Oh, right. Well, do you guys have something you might want to say to the folks out there? Yeah. Call in your pledges now, and, and you'll be helping me and my brother and all of Jerry's kids. So please call your pledges now. Ricky? Very good. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Listen, guys, thanks very much. We appreciate that. So, hey, if you guys come up with any more songs, you going to come back and uh, sing them for us again? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Next year, you're going to have to uh, rhyme with 26 instead of 25, all right? Okay. All right. 
All right. Thanks, guys. All right, 26. It'll be 26 years that Jerry's been doing this. <laughs> Can't even count that high yet. All right, Ricky. Thank you very much. We appreciate you guys so much, okay? Ricky and Tony Wilson, thank you very much. Let's go back to Dave right now. Dave, bye. The Rappin' Wilson brothers. All right. We've got, this is called the Star Wall. This is something new this year, and it really is your chance to be a star here at the 25th Jerry Lewis Telethon. You can be a star. It's very simple. If you make a $100 pledge like the South Alabama Professional Title Service Company, you get a star up on the wall, a silver star. John A. Johnson uh, gave us a $100 pledge, got his star on the wall. He is a star. Fletcher's Barbecue, a $100 pledge. They are stars today. Uh, for $200, a $200 pledge gets you a gold star. Gulf Coast Federal Credit Union, a gold star. W. Elmer gave, uh, let's see, $200 and got a gold star. That's all it takes. You can be a star this weekend in the fight against muscular dystrophy. You get recognition up here on the star wall, and you also do a great deal to fight neuromuscular diseases. It's just that simple. But what is important is that you give us a call, whether it's for $100, $200, or a $1 or a $2 pledge. Please make that pledge today. It is very important. 432-9020 in Mobile in Pensacola, 456-1300. Let us hear from you this morning. Don't put it off until this afternoon when Jerry is uh, down to the wire. Let's hear from you right now. Don't procrastinate. Please give us a call. We have another check presentation at the other side of the studio. Gentlemen, what have you got for us? We got a little bitty girl that throws a pretty big punch. Uh, she's got a, she's got I a wouldn't little... say anything about being a little bitty. <laughs> <laughs> Your name is Noni like Tony Lucas. Right. Hi, nice to see y'all. Yeah. Glad to be here. I don't know if I like these microphones. Stereo. Good stereo. What you got for us, Noni? Uh, we've got a check for, uh, from Yunes Academy. The students from our DIP uh, studio and our Airport Boulevard studio got together. We had a kickathon. We raised five. Five hundred and twenty dollars. Wow, and that is great. Cents. What is it? I'm sorry, what? And ninety-one cents. Ninety-one Don't cents. Don't forget the ninety-one. We'll let John Ed kick so. in the other nine cents and make it right. an even five hundred twenty-one. Okay, okay. Jack. He's but got anyways. the kind of pocket change. And this is for Master Yoon, right? Master Yoon's World Taekwondo Academy. Also, I'm here working with Brown and Roots Volunteer Council. I'm on parole from jail right now. If anybody has any more <laughs> pledges, I still need to raise two hundred fifty dollars. Okay. Noni, thank you very much. <laughs> Nice talking with you, Noni. All right. <laughs> Come, all right, let's go back to Dave Straker. <laughs> I, I figure that's the best way to get it. Carol Harry. Carol, you're not working right now. I'm a, I have a, a challenge here. What's the challenge? To all of the... Uh, residents of Turtle Creek Apartments and uh, Tommy and Susan Clay send in the pledge. And it's a $10 pledge? The, the pledge is $10. All right. Well, you heard it here first, folks. I, pl I challenge everybody. Let's just put an end to the challenges right now. I challenge everybody to get to the phone and make a pledge this morning. It doesn't take much. A $1, $2 pledge, $10, $20 if you can afford it, but please make that pledge today. For a $100 pledge, you make it up on our star wall with a silver star. A $200 pledge gets you a gold star on the star wall. Whatever you can afford, please help us out today.